one got more to the Minecraft found. Jimmy Swift's skills will drive you wild from a treehouse to a city bank. It's the Minecraft files all day. Hi, that was a good one. I like that one a lot. Hey, what's going on, Turches? It's Jimmy Sapir, and welcome back to the Minecraft Files. This is episode 66 in season 6. And today is Friday, which means it's TQF, which stands for Triple Question Friday. And as you guys know, every week on Fridays, I take three questions and I answer them during this episode. And the questions are from you guys in every episode as well. You guys make sure to leave those questions down below in the Swifter section. And the following Friday, I will pick three and answer them. Now today, I've got a very special episode, you guys. This is one we've been working towards for a long time. A really, really long time, probably a couple months, in fact. Um, I sort of switched my direction uh, for this season in terms of like what I wanted to do from just like building a farm, sort of over to like um, more technical stuff slash really getting down to beating both bosses around Halloween. Um, so uh, it was a couple months ago, right at the end of October, obviously, and uh, that was when I faced off against a wither in a sort of like you know, special episode dream type sequence thing that I put together for you guys. I thought it was kind of creative, it was a little bit, it was kind of fun. But then I got to side and I said, look, I want to go ahead and beat this thing for real. So, as we do every Friday, I set a goal for you guys, and the goal for this week is 20,000 likes. I'm upping it from the last episode because we've been working towards this for so freaking long, and it's finally here! I am so pumped. Stars is out here, he's ready to go, he's tied up, he's safe. So here's what we're gonna do, guys. I'm gonna take the very first question on TQF, and then we're gonna go get into this. So the first question comes from Will Dash, who says, do you like Scooby-Doo? My answer, sir, is yes, I do like Scooby-Doo. In fact, I used to watch Scooby-Doo a lot when I was a kid. So yeah, take that, Wither Boss. We're talking about Scooby-Doo right before you die. How disrespectful is that? Woo! All right, I'm pumped. <laughs> But uh, yeah guys, if you're excited for this episode, be sure to hit that like button down below. Let's see if we can shatter that goal of 20,000 likes. And I'm gonna fight this wither boss out here in the desert. So let me go ahead and eat up here. Uh, we're wasting daytime, but it's okay. So I've got the necessary supplies. I've got the potion of swiftness. Um, we're gonna be taking that quick. All right, so let's do this. Let's do this, here we go. Boom, boom. That was creepy, that one like moved a little bit. All right, here's what we're gonna do. Before we go, we're gonna drink this. Okay, get this out of here. I wanted to roll right into this today, like right freaking into it, and I'm not wasting any time. Okay, here we go. Whew. Here it is, here it is, the beginning. All right, bring it on, brother, bring it on. All right, wait till he gets, uh. oh, oh didn't mean to do that. Whew. Oh gosh, all right. So, he's on. Game on. Oh, baby. I need to eat one of these. All right, give me that absorption. Yes. Oh, no, I do that. We're off to a bad start. Take that, Wither. Take that, Wither. Yes. Mm, where my heart's at? Okay, I got like nine. We're good, we're good. Run away, run away, run away. Oh man, he's fast. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. I need another. I need another regen. Get me out of here for just a second. I need to re I need to regroup. Okay. Alright, buddy. Let's take you down some more. Oh gosh. I need another golden apple. Oh gosh. Oh no, I didn't mean to do all that. What am I doing today? This is not a good one. Oh, he's in range! Ugh. Kind of straight punch this sucker down. You are dead. You are dead. Get out of my world. Woo! Yes, that is how you do it. Give me that star. Where are we at? Where are we at? Okay. All right. Let's not die here. Let's not die here. Oh, three hearts. Three hearts. Well, oh, bam. Thank you. Oh my goodness. We just destroyed the whole desert. But look at this. We have a legit Nether star. And where is all the XP I was supposed to get from that? Where did that, where did that go? He doesn't give like a ton, but he gives enough that I thought I would get up to like maybe level 50 or something. I don't know, I probably should have enchanted something and gone down to zero before, but oh well, it is what it is. So <laughs> despite all of the sort of mishaps there, the uh, errant 
Ender Pearl throwing, the panicking, the jittery, the jittery hands, um, and whatnot. Uh, we pulled it out. We pulled it out. Thanks to those golden apples, um, and me just generally being stupid. That was maybe one of the worst wither battles I could ever do. However, I thought I'd throw a twist in here today. You guys want to see me beat another one? Yeah, let's do it. I've got enough supplies to beat another one. I think I think I want to do two today. I mean, look, that was short. That was like five minutes. We've only been recording here for like five minutes. We got ourselves another star. Let's take a look at the achievement tree here. Um, all we got to do is make a beacon, the beaconator, and we should be good to go in terms of um, all of the enchant or uh, achievements. I'm sorry. So um, yeah, I think I'm I think I'm up for doing another one. If you guys are up for watching another one, because that was pretty fast. Like I knew. Okay, I knew that this one was going to be. What effect is still on me? Oh, absorption? Oh, cool. Uh, I knew that this uh, episode was going to be shorter than the Ender Dragon one. Because the Ender Dragon one, that battle takes longer. And it's just, you got to like go to the end and everything. Um, so, not sure if I'm going to be doing anything else today besides beating two Wither Bosses. I thought about, okay, here's the secret. I thought about fighting two at once. And I'm really glad I didn't do that because I definitely would have died. <laughs> that one right there almost killed me. And even that uh, speed potion of um, speed two, like barely keeps you out of range. Okay, we need to take this. I need this. We're gonna have to go to the, the nether and get another one of those, because I like putting those on my post there. Um, yeah, but even even still, um, the freaking speed potions, I couldn't, I still couldn't run away. I kept taking damage from his stupid skulls. So that was a bit scary. All right, but I think we can do this again. I think we can do this again. So I'm going to, uh, come down here. We're gonna drop off some some goodies and some supplies. Uh, get just reorganized just for a, a minute here. Um, got some speed potions. I don't think I'm gonna need multiple of those really, but I do need to drop off the sand because we got a lot of sand. So let's put the sand away. Oops. Let's do that. 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 All right. So. Um, yeah, could have gone better. I'm gonna see if I can make this next one better. Oh, and also, I want to enchant something. Um, oh shoot! Dang it, I loaded up the newest snapshot for this one. Let me go back because I don't wanna, uh, I don't wanna use the new enchantment thingy, um, with like the lapis stuff right now. I don't want to do that. I just want to use 1.7. I forgot that I was on the latest snapshot. All right, I'll be right back. All right, and we're back playing in 1.7.4. Uh, yes, 1.7.4. All right, so um, I want to enchant something. Um, and I don't know what I want to enchant because I have quite a bit of good gear. Um, trying to think uh, if there's anything that I should enchant here. Uh, we've got a lot of chest plates. None really that I love other than this one. Um, da, 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 da. All these have projectile protection. This one's not bad. Um, I think we're lacking... Uh, we could get a better pair of pants. Like this one's got protection three and I'm gonna keep wearing it for the next wither, bo uh, wither battle. But this one's, oh, it only has protection three. So we might actually get uh, an advantage if I, well, I, I don't know, I've got the levels to spend. So let's just enchant uh, another pair of pants and um, see if we can get one that has uh, protection plus some other cool stuff uh, like fire resistance and whatnot. Uh oh, is it, is it nighttime? I should sleep. Yes, perfect. Get rid of that rain. Get that rain out of here. All right, the next question for TQF is coming from Chloe Love, who says, if you could create a movie, this is a great question. If you could create a movie, what movie would you create? Who would be the characters? What would you call it? And what would it be about? Okay, so I picked this question because I didn't know, like, I, I don't know. Like, personally, I, I gotta answer you, truthfully. Oh, come on, Projectile Protection and Unbreaking 3? No, that's not what I wanted. Um, I don't know, like, a good answer to that. However, I, if I, if I were to ever, like, make a movie, I would uh, probably make like a spy related movie. I love like spy movies and stuff like that. And, um, or a heist type thing. Basically, well, okay, you guys remember when I tried to do the Kickstarter uh, this past year, right? That was for an idea that I had for something along those lines. It was gonna be a spy related like mini web series, you know? Like five episodes of 
uh, like high production quality um, type stuff that would la you know each episode would be like anywhere from like five to ten minutes so not like super long but enough to like tell a really cool story um, so I don't know like at this point in my entertainment career air quotes or whatever uh, I have big aspirations to like do, go and do stuff like that, do more stuff like World War II Power Glove. Um, I would absolutely love to do stuff like that. And uh, the you know obviously the problem is is funding. Like that's that's the big problem um, with uh, doing things like that. Is it costs a lot of money, like way more than I have. And believe me, I wouldn't even spend it because like if I had it I wouldn't spend it because I'm trying to like you know save for the future and be a responsible adult now that I'm married but uh <laughs> anyways so I'm still you know pursuing that it's definitely a dream of mine to um to you know make uh make content like that um I need to make some more potions of instant healing how do i it's instant healing is it glistering melon i think it's glistering melon um so anyway so that is like it's definitely a passion of mine to do stuff like that what the heck was there a creeper in here what are you kidding me that scared the crap out of me what on earth oh i just had a heart attack Oh my gosh, I'm like trying to explain like my 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 career dreams and, and like where I want to go in life sometimes and just like things I want to do in my life and the freaking creepers are like now what <laughs> okay all right interesting so I was as I was saying I'm gonna repair this later uh, as I was saying um, definitely uh, want to pursue stuff like that now in terms of like feature films and stuff like the question was asking uh i don't know i don't know um i don't have like any plans i mean that's come on that's like ridiculously like a lofty goal i want to be a feature filmmaker like hey if that's what you want to do do it but i'm just saying i don't think that that's where i want it like where i want to do um but that being said i would love to create really awesome live action content especially for my youtube channel and so um definitely something i'm still looking into and to answer your question chloe let me let me think about this for a minute so if you could create a movie or let's just say or a show what would the movie be about what would you create who would be the characters what would you call it what would it be about all right so let's just take for instance power glove i would love to do some more stuff with power glove in the world war ii universe so yeah it'd be called something like that characters would be myself and some of the other people that you saw in the original one. Plus, we'd add more characters, and it would basically be a, a, uh, you know, fictional World War II show about this like mysterious. And this is what the original one was basically about: is a fictional piece about this mysterious item, this power glove that had these special powers, right? and it changes the tide of war in World War II. And it's basically sort of like explains how the US beat, you know, Nazi Germany in in, uh, in World War II or whatever. And it's just like a fictional tale, which is hilarious because everyone that watched that video was like, um, everyone that watched that video was like, this isn't real, they never had this in World War No crap, they didn't have that in World War II. It's called fiction. But that would probably, Chloe, be what it would be about. Or if I were to pursue the idea that I had for my Kickstarter called Swift, it was about a you know special agent named uh, Jack Swift, and um, that's like you know what that one would be about essentially. Um, so yeah, I don't know. That's just kind of like my my thing. Um, want to definitely you know pursue that further over the next you know like year, year and a half, two years, whatever. Uh, and just kind of see where that leads, see if I can make some more cool content like that for you guys. So, anyways, that is that. Is that. I thought it was a great question, a multi-part question at that, and uh, I definitely wanted to answer it, so I'm sorry that was a little long-winded there, but we're making potions, because I need some more of these splash potions of instant healing, because my gosh, I botched the first batch uh, pretty badly. All right, so, um, we need some more bottles of water. Uh, so I can make more potions just later in life.
Uh, <laughs> so, all right, I'm in like a really silly mood today, but I love it. All right, so let's do this right there. And we're gonna hit this up with one of those beautiful exploding nether warts, because that freaking creeper or something just jumped me. How, okay, how was he in here? Like, I ran in, I checked this chest for like a good little while. I ran out, I didn't see anything. I'll have to look at the footage, maybe I missed it. Sometimes I don't see stuff. Came out here, went back in, put these things in, heard a sizzle, and he exploded. I think. There, I didn't put TNT down here. There's not even TNT. Freaking, freaking mysteries. Okay. <sighs> Enough of that. All right, now what I need, poor, poor potions room. It needed an upgrade anyway, I think. It was kind of bland. So what I need to do now is make some more golden apples. Um, those things are huge. Um, definite, definite bonus. Um, so let's do... Uh, here, let's do, um, three, three more golden apples, I think. Should we do that? I've got the gold. I got the go. Give me the go. All right, let's go down here. I'm going to uh, make some more golden apples before we fight this next guy. Just needed to restock a bit. So, what did I say? Three or four? Three. Okay. Bingo. All right, nailed it. There we go. Um, potion of strength, dude. That oh my gosh, potion of strength plus smite. It just like wrecks him. It, like totally wrecks him. Whew. Okay. So let's. Uh, ah, dang it. All right. What I need to do now, I guess, since we are going to wait for uh, nighttime so I can sleep and then hit him up for the daytime uh, again. Then the next, the next one. I'm going to make. A beacon and finally complete this tree of achievements where is my obsidian do I oh okay cool I have some all right perfect so let's do this let's do this and well BAM beacon wait why did I okay hold on how is this create a f oh create a full beacon like a working beacon or just like a okay I'm confused do I create a working beacon or do I create like a like a full full beacon I am assuming since it says beaconator it probably means a full beacon which I almost have down below here this is like on the second to last one but just for the sake of the achievement oh wait hold on like this there we go uh, I'm going to attempt to put this here and see what happens. No, it's not going to do it. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Um, well then, I guess we need to, at some point, are you going to break? There we go. Uh, make that beacon into a full beacon. I might have enough uh, blocks to do that. I thought that that last achievement was just to create a beacon, but it's not. It's actually to make the full uh, the full thing, like, like actually expand it out so it's the max pyramid. Um, which is cool. I needed to do that anyway, so. Um, winner, winner, chicken dinner. Alright, let's, um, put these back. Uh, let's put the glass back down here. Nighttime should be approaching soon. I'm sort of, like, dilly-dallying right now, just kind of, like, doing whatever. Just sort of wasting time here. Because I really want to sleep again. I don't want to fight him at night. That would be, like, the worst thing in the world. Um, alright, so... I don't need this many potions of swiftness, I don't think. Just in case I die or something awful happens, let's just leave it down here. Um, there we go. Okay, two should be good. All right. <laughs> so, it's almost time for that night. Um, I'm actually gonna leave. I didn't even use my shovel either. I'm gonna leave that here. Oh gosh, almost. Why did I not put that in that chest either? The fortune three pick. Um, all right, let's move this down to there. That way it'll give me space here to splash some potions on myself should I need it. All right, guys. It's almost that time again. Almost wither two. Wither number two. Numero dos time. And we've got 16 levels, so I want to see how many levels like I get from the uh, next boss. Um, if I was at zero, I'd be... It would be easier to essentially um, calculate. Although I could probably, I could probably put an item into the anvil with some diamonds and repair it. 
like the Blade of Flames. Huh, he's running a little bit low. That'll be perfect. That shouldn't use, well, it might use more than, let's take two diamonds. We'll just see what happens real fast and then we'll sleep. Uh, actually, no, let's sleep first because who knows, those stupid zombies might come. But this might actually bring me down to zero levels, at which point then I'll be able to gauge accurately sort of how many, how much experience you gain from killing a wither. I think, I think if I'm correct, it's like 150 or something like that, 150 experience points, but I wanna see how many actual levels that gives you. So let's do this. Yeah, 27, ouch. Okay, I, I don't even have enough. Yikes. Well, that's disappointing. Um, I am determined, I am determined to, to do this. Ah, get up there. Okay. Happy Friday, happy Friday. Uh, wait. I still might be able to do this, but just not on the Blade of Flames. So, right there. Looting. Let's try, let's try just repairing the, uh, looting sword. Even though it doesn't really need it. But look, I've got a mob grinder at this point. I'm not too concerned with the level issue here. All right, so let's do that. What? It's a good, oh, <laughs> it's cause it has looting three and sharpness five. Cause this is like a freaking beast sword if I've ever seen one. Well, what the heck? What the heck? All right, maybe play these games. Let's repair these diamond leggings then. Fine, unenchanted. I should be able to do this for less, less than 16 levels, right? Please? Oh, two? It's only gonna cost me, wait, what? How? How is that possible? I don't wanna even do that. No, I'm scrapping this idea. That's like a waste. That's a waste of two diamonds, in my opinion. I mean, it's a good deal, yeah, but. Oh, wait, this chest plate though. Let's try it. Let's try it. I'm looking for something that's like, oh, this will cost you 15 levels. I'm like, sweet, thank you. Too expensive? You gotta be, get out of here. Can't even do that. Can't even do that. What? <sighs> Minecraft, please. This is 1.7.4, like, I thought that it would cost more than two levels to enchant, or uh, to repair, excuse me, a pair of normal diamond leggings. Apparently I'm wrong, I, I don't know. But whatever, I'm just gonna go with this here. So let's head back out there uh, before we lose the daylight. And uh, let's go ahead and beat ourselves up. Another wither! Since I wasn't satisfied with doing one. <laughs> but yeah, I will have to go back to the nether at some point and uh, get another wither skull to put on my post over there. Um, also, oh yeah, I forgot to, I probably should have mentioned this at the beginning of, of the episode. So I looked at the mod that I wanted to install for Minecraft. Still don't want to say what it is yet because a lot of, uh, well, I, I want to keep it a secret. I want to keep it a secret. Also, my mouth is feeling way better, which is good. Um, as you can probably tell by my enthusiasm and just general attitude at the moment. Uh, <laughs> anyways, so, unfortunately, the mo for okay, Forge has not updated yet to 1.7.4. This world has 1.7 elements in all over it. All freaking over it. In the blocks that I've used and, and all sorts of things. Which makes me nervous about going back to 1.6.4 just to install a mod. So, either I wait for Forge to upload or to update to 1.7.4 and then wait for the stinking mod that I want to update beyond 1.6.4 by the way it's not i've never even reviewed this mod it's a mod i've never reviewed so a lot of people keep speculating like oh he just reviewed this mod that's what he's gonna put in the minecraft files not true not true but um let's let's build up this battlefield a little bit just so i don't like fall in some like really nasty holes or something and die um while i explain this anyways so what i'm what i'm trying to say is i'm sort of stuck which really stinks because um Forge is like they're not uh, updating very fast. I guess I don't know how this works personally um, Supposedly Mojang like totally redid all the code or something like that and uh, It's been taking Forge a really long time to update and therefore all the mods are still just at 1.6.4 Which is really annoying not gonna lie um, Because I've moved on from 1.6.4 look 1.7 has been out for like months a couple months now I think 
And so I want to, you know, start using mods that are 1.7. Problem is, this mod is still, the mod that I want to use, is still at 1.6.4. As are pretty much every other mod out there. So it's not like I can just drop the idea of this mod, um, which has yet to be named because I'm trying to keep it a secret, <laughs> and um, just use another one. I can't do that because I don't want to take my world back to 1.6.4, especially with the 1.7 elements that I already have in here. So I'm sort of in like a predicament here, which is a bit of a bummer. And I think all, all the all the sand despawned at this point. Oh no, there's some more over here. Um, so yeah guys, I don't really know what I'm gonna do, uh, one, one idea I did come up with that I want to keep working on potentially in this world is like an ice base out at the, um, the ice, uh, spikes biome that I found a, a while back, and a lot of people wanted me to make, you know, um, like a fortress of solitude or something out there, so that could be a project that I work on as well. Um, there are other projects that are gonna take like a lot more thought and time. And it probably I don't know how I don't know how I'm gonna pack them into episodes, much like the sheep, the colored uh, wool sheep system thingy that I have been talking about before. Um, that is going to take you know a lot of work to do because I don't know how to do that stuff. Um, so, anyways, I'll figure something out. But I just wanted to give you guys an update on that. Now it's time to do another wither. So let's do this. Enough enough chit chat. And then once we kill this sucker. I'm going to get to the last question TQF and then we'll call it an episode. All right. So before we do this, we're going to take another speed potion. Oh, brother. Hey. And let's do that. Wither, wither. So let's do this. Okay. Wait till he gets fully charged. I'm going to hit him with a full charge arrow here. Woohoo! Ah, ah, ah. Okay, run away. Woo. Woo, woo. I need a golden apple. These are, these are huge. These are so important. Let's make easy work of this guy. Ah, I missed. Oh crap, he's backing me in the hole. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Okay. I think I'm okay. I just want to get some regeneration going here to combat all of the wither. I can't get stuck in a hole. Yes. Come on, fight it. Oh gosh, he's gonna put me in a hole. Yikes! Yikes! Run! Run, Jim! Oh yeah, we're getting a good good sprint away here. Oh, he's right by me! Alright, as soon as there he goes. I don't know how you can use the strength potion. I got smite, baby! You were dead! Oh dang, fall damage. Good thing I got feather falling. Yes! Get dead, brother! Woo! I did it again! Yes! Alright, where's my wither star? There it is. Hooray! Wow, that only gave me two levels? Like, I'm literally up to, I went from 16 to 18? That's not cool. That's pretty, that's pretty weak. Um, well, alright, fun stuff. Let's go home. Um, sweet. Take me to my horse, please. Thank you. All right, awesome. Oh, cool. The Ender Pearl like knocked off my, it knocked off the uh, <laughs> the the lead there. That was pretty sweet. Wow. All right. So two Wither bosses in one episode. That was pretty cool. That was a lot of fun. Those guys are they're definitely challenging, but easily beatable if you've got the right gear. And I definitely had the right gear. So I made e pretty easy work of two Withers. Uh, I hope that you guys enjoyed that. Let me go ahead and get to the last question of TQF. And this one comes from Amar Alteyeb, I think is how you pronounce the last name. He says, what is the most score of diamonds you have ever received in Minecraft? The most score of diamonds I've ever received in Minecraft, I think is probably, uh, it happened to me recently actually with my new Fortune 3 pick. Uh, and I might have had a better haul than this at one point. Um, I just honestly can't remember exactly. But, uh, I turned like eight diamonds or eight diamond blocks basically into, um, something like, uh, 28 or something, 21 or 28, some, somewhere around there. I know it's a big gap there. Oh, it's a gap of seven. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, it was a, it was a really good haul. The fortune three picks are freaking beast. So turning like eight, you know, what should be eight diamonds into, um, 
uh, like over 20 it, uh, was awesome. So yeah, that was probably my the best score of diamonds that I've ever had. But thank you, Surfters, so much for watching this episode, you guys. Um, if I don't really have anything planned for Monday, um, obviously your, all your suggestions are completely welcome. Like, please leave suggestions. Please leave uh, your TQF questions as well for the next TQF episode um, down below. I sort of feel like I've done everything and vanilla Minecraft right now, and so I'm definitely looking forward to a mod. I'm gonna try and find a way around this issue, but like I said, guys, it's sort of I'm sort of stuck. Um, got this 1.7.4 world with you know elements of 1.7 in it, um, and uh, you know I don't know how that's gonna work if I you go back. Like I've got new biomes in here and everything. What, what's gonna happen to that if I revert back to an old uh, you know old version of Minecraft? Is that gonna, is it gonna glitch it out? I don't know. I've never really done that before. But uh, I'm definitely looking into it, and I will keep you guys updated. So if there is no episode on Monday, I'll definitely let you guys know. I don't foresee that happening. It'll probably be an episode. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this episode. I'm sorry that those wither battles were so short. They do die pretty easily. But I hope you guys enjoyed it anyway. So have a great weekend, everyone. And um, make sure you check out my videos coming out this weekend as well. It should be very, very fun. And I will talk to you guys later. Have a good Friday. Peace.